Hey folks, welcome back for another narrated PBR battle. Um, as you can see from the length of this video, this one was a doozy. Um, again, using my UU doubles team against a random opponent off Wi-Fi. Uh, this guy is using Ubers and lots of them. Um, I'm thinking I don't have much chance with these with these guys, but I'm going to give it my all. Um, I consider my options for a while. Uh, Rotom is definitely the best choice for a, uh, a lead uh, as it can take on uh, Lugia, Giratina, uh, Ho-Oh, um, and can do a uh, Tyranitar for sure. Um, for my other two, I kind of think for a while. Um, Lantern seems like a good bet. Um, and finally, I set, settle on Lantern and Steelix for my back two and um, my Torterra for my other lead. Uh, so here I go. I'm really hoping that this guy doesn't know what he's doing and is just spamming Ubers. Uh, I set up Rotom with a substitute. Uh, gives me a little bit of scouting time and will allow me to set up a subcharge if it's successful. Um, switch out uh, my Torterra for uh, my Lantern. And he attacks with fake out against uh, lantern, so that was a great uh, that was a great move. Didn't really cost me anything. And Rotom gets his substitute off without a hitch. Yeah, this turned out to be a really great move for me. He uh, his ho -Oh uses a substitute, uh, which is uh, great for me. Um, yeah, he's using the same strategy I am, I guess. Uh, Substitute leftovers with his uh, ho -Oh. uh, Lantern restores most of the damage done by uh, fake out, so uh, poor move on his part. Um, I hit ho -Oh with uh, Charge Beam uh, and decide to Hydro Pump ho -Oh. uh, The idea is uh, Charge Beam should take down the sub, and then uh, Hydro Pump should uh, take down ho -Oh, hopefully. Um, and the first part of the strategy goes off without a hitch. Uh, the substitute is down. And Rotom gets a special attack boost to, to boot. Ho uses Sacred Fire against uh, Lantern. Not exactly sure why. Uh, it just uh, does very little damage. Ludicolo does Grass Knot. Uh, and even with the crit, Lantern survives. Uh, one of my favorite tanks. And then Hydro Pump misses. So, uh, he get, uh, so he's got two lucky. Uh, he's got two bits of luck going for him. Uh, leftover recovery. Rotom charge beams ho -Oh again. And I'm just trying the same strategy as before. I really want to take out that ho -Oh. um, And he really doesn't want ho -Oh to go down, so he pulls him back and sends out his Giratina. So now both of my moves are not going to are going to be uh, not very effective. So good switch, good prediction. Ludicolo uses Swagger to power up uh, Giratina. Uh, he's holding a Lumberry, so this guy is going to hit hard. But you know what? I'm actually not that upset. So, okay, I lost a turn, but I'm actually not that upset that uh, he switched out Giratina because I've got Shadow Ball that's already got a plus one boost. Um, and I've got Ice Beam on Lantern, uh, that should, uh, which is going to do a considerable amount of damage to uh, that Dragon type. You know, really, really, the problem with Lantern is that there's only one of them. Uh, I would love to have, you know, I could make a team of just Lanterns, and they'd be able to pretty much, uh, they'd be able to cover almost all Ubers that I can think of. So he sends out Tyranitar, whips up a Sandstorm. Um, that's really not going to hurt me too much, uh, but it is going to, but it'll do a little bit of damage to him. Uh, so he shadow sneaks my lantern. Was not expecting that. Lantern is down, unable to pull off the ice beam. Uh, I am uh, I am unhappy about that. Uh, shadow ball hits. Not uh, does a lot of damage, but not quite enough to give, deliver the KO. Oh well. Um, what a shame. I send out Steelix. Uh, since it can wall most of this, 
Uh, Shadow Ball against Giratina. I want that sucker down. Um, and I use Earthquake to, um, since it'll be super effective against Tyranitar anyway. Giratina uses Protect, uh, predict my move. Or time uses Shadow Ball, it does nothing. Uh, Tyranitar uses Rock Slide, but I have a bit of luck here. Uh, Rotom avoids the attack, and Steelix uh, not only is it not very effective, but it doesn't even get, uh, get the flinch. So Steelix pulls off an Earthquake, uh, misses the ground with Levitate, does a lot of damage to Tyranitar. Rotom uses Shadow Ball. I really want that Kiratina dead. Uh, I want to be able to say I took down one uh, one of his guys at least. I use Earthquake, uh, basically so the same strategy as the last turn. He pulls back his Giratina, probably a pretty smart move, and sends out Ho-Oh. Shadow Ball does a fair amount of damage, um, but I really wish I'd been able to take down that... Uh, that uh, Giratina. Uh, gets a crit off of um, Rotom, although it's behind a substitute. And then this is the part that uh, pissed me off. He gets a flinch. Uh, I mean, oh well. Uh, now I just want to take down one of his guys, so I'm charge beaming uh, against Ho-Oh and stone edging against Ho-Oh as well. I want that guy down. I want someone down. I, want, I don't want this to be a complete uh, shutout. Rotom gets a spec attack boost. Uh, would probably be nice if you were still behind a substitute. Um, Sacred Fire luckily is a physical attack uh, and unfortunately gets the burn. Um, not that happy about this. Uh, and then Tyranitar uses uh, Stab Crunch against Rotom. Rotom is down so I don't get a chance to pull off another attack. Oh well. Felix uses Stone Edge, and I get a KO. I take down his Ho-Oh. That makes me happy. That makes me really happy uh, that this wasn't a complete, uh, that he didn't completely sweep me. I send out Torterra since it's my last guy. I don't have much other choice. He sends out Ludicolo. This match is pretty much over. Um, I use Woodhammer against Tyranitar. I probably should have used Leaf Storm. But I did not want the attack to miss. Oh, Tyranitar uses Protect anyway, so it's not like it mattered. Ludicolo uses Fake Out against uh, Steelix. So I get I pull off no attacks that turn. Really. Woodhammer does nothing. Steelix flinched. Uh, I use Woodhammer against Tyranitar again. Just repeat the same thing. I just couldn't see a better option. Ludicolo uses Grass Knot, takes out Steelix with a crit. I'm not sure if it would have KO'd without the crit, but he's getting a lot of crits and a lot of luck this game. Uh, and it's not even like he needed it. He was running Ubers. So the Poke Gods were not smiling on me today. Torterra's defense fell. <laughs> Great. So I do get the wood hammer hit, and Tyranitar is down. So that's two that's two KOs for me. Uh, but now I'm down to one guy, and he still got uh, his uh, Giratina. So I'm hoping to take down someone. I've still got half HP. Uh, Earthquake should you know Giratina Giratina is pretty low on health. Grass Knot. Not quite enough to KO. Really hoping uh, I can pull off an attack. Giratina vanishes instantly using Shadow Force. Um, so I'm not even able to pull that off. Uh, Earthquake's not going to do anything against Ludicolo. And this match is over. Uh, I'm, you know, it's, o it's over. I'm just waiting for the attack to hit. Oh well. Uh, you know, my guys did really well considering they were up against you know, two, uh, two Ubers and two people who do really well in double format uh, Uber battles. 
Um, so that's that. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. Uh, oh, and challenge. Don't forget the challenge. And I'll have more battle videos for you soon. Uh, peace out.